Welcome to Gray on Map. We are asked to solve this problem. We have two squares, and these two squares have Welcome to Gray on Map. We are asked to solve this problem. We have two squares, and these two squares are put side by side, and a diagonal is drawn from this point of the smaller square to the point of the larger square. And another diagonal is drawn from the intersection of this, the first diagonal and the point of this larger square. And the side lengths of the squares are 6 and 4. We are required to find the area of the shaded region. Okay, so first thing that we have to notice is that these two areas are actually composed, I mean the area is composed of two areas which are right triangles. And notice that the smaller right triangle, this one, is actually similar to this larger right triangle, this white right triangle, because of this vertical angle and this vertical angle. And this is 90 degrees, and this is 90 degrees, and this is another angle corresponding to each other that are congruent to each other. So by angle 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 theorem these two triangles are similar okay so to find the area of these two triangles is since they are composed of two uh, triangles then this first triangle we just add to the area of this second triangle but since we all know their bases for this larger blue triangle is 6 and the height is this length and this other length for the smaller so we just need to find this length first let's call this as x and that will be easy to find the area of the blue region in total okay so if that is x and this is 4 because the side length of the smaller square is 4 and this is actually 4 minus x because the total is 4 so we have 4 minus x and we can use actually since these two triangles are similar we can use ratio and proportion we have for the smaller triangle we have x over 4 is equal to the ratio of the shorter to the longer leg we have 4 minus x all over 6 so we have 6x is equal to 4 times 4 minus x then we have 6x is equal to 16 minus 4x then we have 10x if we put this negative 4x to the left hand side it becomes 10 so this becomes 16 so if we divide this by 10 both sides then we have x is equal to 16 over 10 and we divide by 5 so we have x is equal to 8 over 5 units okay so this length earlier we label this x and the value is 8 over 5 and this is 4 and this is actually for this length is actually 6 minus 4 so this becomes 2 and this length is actually 6 so it is now easy to find the area of this blue region okay so for the area it's equal to 1 half times the base of this larger which is 6 times the height which is 2 plus 8 over 5 plus one half times the base which is four times the height which is eight over five okay so we cancel this this becomes three area is equal to three times lcd is five times two ten plus five divided by five is equal to one so eight plus one half I mean four divided by two is two 
times 8 over 5. So this becomes 18. 18 times 3 is 54 over 5 plus 16 over 5 for the area. So area is equal to 54 plus 16 is actually 70 divided by 5. So the area is actually 14 square units. And that is our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. So you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.